hi everyone in this video i am going to explain about the various parameters like wavelength phase velocity propagation constant and characteristic impedance of these micro strip transmission lines so first let us see what is the formula for the wavelength or guide wavelength of this micro strip transmission lines so guide wavelength we can say it is guide wavelength instead of simply wavelength we can say it is a guide wavelength guide wavelength of micro strip transmission line so guide wavelength is indicated by lambda g guide wavelength is represented by lambda g so that is wavelength for any transmission line wavelength for any transmission line can be calculated can be calculated by dividing by dividing free space wavelength sorry free space wavelength by dividing the free space wavelength free space wavelength is indicated by lambda naught by the square root <coughs> square root of the effective dielectric constant effect sorry square root of the effective dielectric constant effective dielectric constant indicated by represented by epsilon effective okay so wavelength of any transmission line any transmission line means in the case of uh, uh, micro strip transmission line we are discussing here so wavelength for this mic uh, micro strip transmission line is defined as the ratio of we can say it is the ratio of free space wavelength to the effective dielectric constant epsilon effective so that is lambda g is equal to lambda naught divided by epsilon effective whole power 1 by 2 or simply you can write it as lambda naught by root of epsilon effective this is the guide wavelength in the case of micro strip transmission lines guide wavelength in the case of micro strip transmission lines and the second parameter is this is the first parameter guide wavelength of micro strip transmission lines second parameter is phase velocity phase velocity indicated by vp what is the definition of phase velocity what is the definition of phase velocity it is the velocity with which the phase of the wave changes within this micro strip transmission line okay it is defined as it is defined as the velocity with which the phase of the wave changes inside 
the micro strip transmission line inside the micro strip transmission line indicated or represented by vp so vp is equal to it is nothing but the ratio of c by epsilon effective nothing but velocity of light to the the ratio of velocity of light to the dielectric constant under root that means c by epsilon effective whole power 1 by 2 and the same we can write it as root over epsilon effective this is what the phase velocity of the wave that is traveled inside the micro, micro strip transmission line here all the parameters we are uh, dealing here all are belonging to micro strip transmission lines <coughs> next parameter is propagation constant propagation constant In the case of rectangular waveguides and uh, circular waveguides, the propagation constant was indicated by gamma, but here the propagation constant is indicated by beta. Propagation constant is equal to omega mu naught epsilon naught epsilon effective whole power 1 by 2. That means omega root over free space permeability, free space permittivity and dielectric constant, dielectric constant. This is what the beta is. And the last parameter, <coughs> the fourth parameter is characteristic impedance. Characteristic impedance. So, characteristic impedance is represented by Z0. Characteristic impedance is represented by Z0. The characteristic impedance Z0 is also a function of, it is a function of, it is a function of the ratio of the height To the width that means it is a function of ratio of uh, width to the height we can say width to the height of the transmission line of the transmission line And also have and also has separate solutions on the value of width to h width to height. So, the characteristic of impedance Z0 can be calculated as Z0 can be calculated as same in the case as in the case of dielectric constant whatever we have done the same similar expressions we are writing here. First case when width to height is less than 1 Z0 is expressed as 60 divided by effective dielectric constant ln of 8 height to width ratio plus 0 0.25 width to height ohms. This is the case when width to height is less than 1. 
Suppose the width to height is greater than or equal to 1 when width to height is greater than or equal to 1. Z0 is equal to eta. Eta is nothing but 120 pi divided by epsilon effective under root into W by H plus 1.393 plus 2 by 3 ln of width to height plus 1.444 ohms. See all these are experimental values. We no need to go for the calculation of all these individually. Just take the direct expressions. Whenever uh, some problems have been asked on these, you can directly take the same notations and substitute them. Okay, so these are the different parameters of these microstrip transmission lines.